So you might be trying to figure out how you can go ahead and move an application into your hidden folder inside of your app library on iOS 18. Now, doing this is very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you wanna do is you wanna make sure you have your face ID and or passcode set up on your iPhone. So make your way over into your settings. You wanna click into face ID and passcode, which is right here. And you wanna just make sure you have a face ID and passcode or touch ID thing set up. If you don't, well, that's gonna be an issue. So just make sure you have that set up and then you're good to go. Now, what you wanna do next is you wanna find the application that you want to go ahead and hide. So let's say I wanna go ahead and hide Pokemon Go. Let's say I don't want people knowing I play Pokemon or whatever. Well, what you can do is you can go ahead and hold down on that Pokemon Go application or whichever app you want to. And there's going to be a little option that should say require face ID. It will be the first option or the last option or somewhere in between. You wanna go ahead and click on that option. Now this next page is going to come up. So now what you wanna do here is you wanna go ahead and click on the second option right here that says hide and require face ID. So now what you can do is click on hide and require face ID and watch what happens. A little indicator at the very top is gonna to start coming up. That or you can type in your passcode and then it'll tell you that you can hide this application. It'll say it'll be you know basically inside of you. It's not gonna have an application so it's gonna be obscured and there's gonna be no app notifications or calls. So if you're trying to expect notifications and stuff to come through, no notifications are going to come through with that app. So be very careful with it. Now, when you're ready, you can click hide app. It'll go from here. And then you can move all the way into your hidden folder right here. Click into here. It's going to ask for your face ID again. So just scan it. And then when you do it, it'll show you your hidden folder and your hidden icon here. And you can open up this app and it's going to require face ID again. So you can do that from there. So, and then game mode is on too, which I don't even know is enabled yet. That is basically how it works. It's a super basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.